you start using OptiCut, the first thing to do is to set up your materials library. Let's say that we want to generate an optimization of this cutting list here. In this cutting list, we can see that we have material which is called Ply OK19. We have the different sizes of each panel that we want to cut, a total of 24. And we also have the price here of 24.78 euros per meter squared. We also have here on this list the size, the size of the sheets in stock that we will need to be cutting from. We have the number, the total length and width of our sheets. Here we have four sheets of 250 by 122. The first thing that we have to do is to set up the materials list. Click on stock panel materials to open up the materials dialog box. And let's create the material for this list. Click on New, and we see here the materials are called Ply Oak 19. So in the materials name, we're going to put Ply Oak K 19. In the thickness box, let's put the thickness of 19 millimeters. Here we have a box which we can tick called Grain if we need the material to follow the grain, but we do not, so we will leave it unticked. In the description, let's just put a description of the material. Let's put plywood. Okahomi 19 millimeters and here we have the price let's put the price in which is 24.78 euros here we have the price per meter for the cutting let's leave this at 1 euro and let's click OK to set up this material in the same way you can set up other materials and build up a library of materials that you commonly use in your business in my next video, I'll be showing how to set up stock of panels that we will be cutting from. Thank you for watching.